exposure sheet's about to start, and here's outfit number one. În iulie am fost plecată la Londra la invitația Disney Channel pentru a le lua un interviu actrițelor Sabrina Carpenter și Sofia Carta. Cele două actrițe joacă în cel de-al 100-lea film marca Disney Channel Original Movie, Noile aventuri ale dădacilor, care are premiera sâmbătă pe 17 septembrie de la 11.30 la Disney Channel. <laughs> Înainte de interviu, am fost la ședința foto cu Sabrina Carpenter, unde am putut să-i pun câteva întrebări în avans. Nu uitați, dacă aveți nevoie de subtitrări, apăsați CC în dreapta jos ecranului dacă sunteți pe laptop sau pe desktop, iar dacă sunteți pe device-uri mobile, găsiți o sugeată în dreapta sus de unde selectați subtitles. I have a, a deeper question, Sabrina. Yes? How do you define friendship? How do I find friendship? Define. Oh, oh so how do I find it? Oh, it's it's a nice thing. <laughs> I look for it every day. Friends online. are nice to have. <laughs> how do I define friendship? Friendship is being there for each other 100%. Just having that person that at the end of the day you know that you could always talk to um, and that you can trust. Trust is very important. I know. And someone that makes you laugh. Yeah. Because it burns calories, it's really fun, um, and it's just nice. It's nice to be able to laugh with friends. What do you miss more about being a kid? Well, I'm the still most. A kid. I'm not 18 yet. <laughs> I'm 28 and I'm still, still a kid. A kid. <laughs> uh, what do I miss most about, about being child a child? Yeah, a child. About childhood? Yeah. I can get away with so much. Um, by that I mean I could, you know, I could use my like little puppy dog face and stuff. That was a nice part about childhood. I think just the innocence and the imagination is the most like fun thing about childhood because you really don't, you know, y you're so creative and you come up with a lot of um, things that sometimes when we're in our adult mind frame, we tend to stay a little bit more narrow-headed. Cheerio, lovely lady. Cheerio. Cheerio. Cheers. 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 I've heard that. Crumbs, I've heard too. Crumbs, yeah. Crumbs. Like crumbs. Like crumbs. Like you said, like, oh man, oh, oh, okay. My name is Ani Marie, I'm a Romanian YouTuber. My community is called the Martian Community. Ooh. And welcome to my YouTube channel. Welcome, hi. Bună dimineața. Oh my god, great. <laughs> <Right. laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> I went to Romania. Yeah. But yeah. Oh, very cool. Jenny and Lola, let's talk about the casting process for Adventures in Babysitting. How was that for both of you? Yeah, pretty short for both great. of us. I remember I came in on Halloween, um, and I read for the part of Lola on Halloween. I read perfectly. I read for the part of Lola, then I came in again a few weeks later. Did a chemistry with Sabrina, and that was my first read. Was uh, the chemistry first read with with Sophia. That was the first time we'd ever met. The first time we ever met, and we were lucky enough after that to get the part. Yeah, great. we met together one more time with the producers and directors and the executives at, at the channel and. Um, we were. I was driving home when I got the call, as were you. Yeah, um, we were we FaceTiming. Face so she nice. wasn't FaceTiming while driving. No, I was wasn't. I, I had put the phone down. We were like screaming over the phone. It was great. <laughs> Any challenges you faced? Because Sabrina, I know you had a bit of emotion with the driving. Oh, <laughs> a bit of Sabrina, emotional right. stress. I did my research. You know what? It was one of those things where I just did not feel comfortable behind the wheel and driving five children. <laughs> it was a green screen. Let's not worry too much. But um, but it was. It was kind of crazy because I didn't know, you know, about uh, shifting things, gears, you, turn you signals. She's never been in a car. I've never, never, I've never driven in a car, so I don't. So know. like turn signals were new, so it was very cute. It was very. Special. And she I'm learned. Glad. You know how to drive. I do. Yeah, I've been driving for a few years now, so it was quite. It was very cute. Any challenges you faced? Um, you know, I'm a very clumsy human, <laughs> and I happen there happens to be a lot of action in this film. Luckily, there wasn't too many injuries. So for the amount of running we did, I was surprised that more of us didn't, didn't get hurt. Didn't fall or get hurt. Yeah. Fall. Um, so I, I, I did stunts for the first time, which was very cool. Um, but yeah, it was it was a it was you know a movie of first for I think a lot of us, which was very exciting. So I think you answered a little bit of this question, but uh, what was the first impression when you two met? What was the impression of each other? Awful. 
<laughs> I immediately thought that she was perfect. And it's so funny because like for the role, but also just like in real life, I was like, and, and she's such a great actress too. It was so nice to like be able to play off of someone that was oh. so realistic in everything that she did and also just a real human being. Um, yeah, she is real. So no, it was, it was very fun. It was very refreshing to work with someone. It was amazing from the very first second that we met. Well, I had already heard amazing things about her and I had already been a fan, seeing her on the channel and listening to her music. So it was very cool to kind of see how we would bounce off of each other so well, so yeah. quickly. So instant and chemistry. Instant chemistry for sure. And, and then um, it wasn't work, you know, the whole film. Exactly. Was just... It was, and it's still not. Anytime we get to work together is really such a pleasure. And it's an honor to work with her. I can't speak more highly. She's really an incredible, not only the talent that you see on social media and on the channel, but she really is an incredible girl. It's a love fest. Yeah. Thank you. We're very lucky. Yeah, I have a question about girl love, so... Oh good, <laughs> oh, you came to the right people. Uh, favorite line from the movie? Don't mess with, with the, the babysitter. babysitter. Or... <laughs> I'm gonna get a tattoo. Yeah, go have fun, express yourself. My favorite is, speaking of flow, we better get out of oh, here. Oh yeah. <laughs> speaking of... Speaking of flow... <laughs> uh, because you obviously have... <laughs> because you obviously have... Uh, some experience now. How did babysitting change uh, since you were kids? Well, so never. This is this what babysitting is nowadays. I'm a little scared. Well, also, you know what's funny is I feel like our our movie played a little bit more to what babysitting used to be like, which is where you know the, the kids wouldn't necessarily just sit down and watch TV for the night, or maybe that's the plan. I'm not quite sure. Obviously, our plans were a little bit shifted in the film, yeah. but you know nowadays kids are on their iPads for hours and they're they're occupied and um, they watch TV or you know you take them. this was like the dream babysitting experience right like, oh, like the the fun you adventure always kind of want to like go have a crazy adventure like while your parents are out with the babysitter yeah. and like this is exactly what happened you know oh, certain things went wrong just a few things you know but um, overall it was quite the adventure challenge time okay you are babysitting for a toddler and he started oh. crying and his oh. parents are on their way so you have to make the funniest face you can to oh, stop geez. him crying okay a Be funny face or a face that's going to scare him because my funny face tends to be scary because it's quite well, it's, he's already crying okay so don't scare him face. why would you scare him no because sometimes i make faces that's and it's really rude i didn't mean to make I, uh, <laughs> okay, you're fired. i'm not going to do that face you're fired do that face come to jenny okay okay ready? okay okay ready one Two, oh, it's a camera? Three. Yeah. <laughs> I so I didn't make it so I did my monkey. That was cute. Was, yeah. Can I see that? Okay. Oh, that's very cute. See, I would smile if I was a toddler. Yeah. I yeah. used to uh, be able to touch my... To do some... I'm not going to show you. <laughs> <laughs> um, I wasn't sure where that was going. <laughs> No, I thought it would look really bad on camera. Oh, okay. And my subscribers would just unsubscribe. Uh, okay, second challenge. Please, please, please sing, sing a few words from Wild Side. Oh, okay. Good morning. So we go from the hook? Sure. <coughs> Wait, what can you do? You go, you start. No, you start. You start. I'll follow Okay, sounds you. good. Ready? I'm living on the wild side, wild side. No telling what I might find, might find. No stopping because it feels right, feels right. I'm living on the ooh, 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 on the wild but, <laughs> there you go. I, I got goosebumps. <laughs> I love live music. Two main themes on my YouTube channel. Uh, these are some subjects I often talk about. Cyberbullying and girl power, girl love. Um, how do you think you can change the world and the internet? And uh, what message could you send to people so they can realize that we, we should help each other more and not bring each other down? so important and that's such a beautiful message of this film as well is that you know despite the action and the adventure and the comedy that is so fun about this film what drives it is really a relationship between two girls who are really empowering each other and um that's also, really special they also realize that you know even though they're so different from each other yeah it's incredible because if they were the same a lot more could have gone wrong yeah i feel like um, our differences are beautiful and that's what you know gets us through a lot of situations because yeah. her creative mind you know in in certain frantic situations is better than and her, her discipline, discipline is better and her exactly so it really goes to show how no human is exactly the same yeah. and we're thankful for that because that's why there's so many beautiful things in the world that are different yeah. because every 
you know, person looks at things through different lenses. And we have to celebrate our differences and empower other people to embrace them. That's what makes us all beautiful. And I think just by posting things that are positive and beautiful and spread love and um, empowerment, I think that's... And just being yourself is like... Totally. It's the most, being most powerful message. Just don't be afraid to be yourself. And how do you deal with online hate? I because laugh. we all get online hate. Yeah. Sometimes it's funny though. Like I, I look at it, it's like, you know, we're very lucky to be living our dreams yeah. and doing what we love. Um, and the fact that there's people that support us in doing that, we're, we're lucky, lucky to have those people. You know, we, we, we can't make them support us or follow it or whatever it may be. So we're just lucky to have them. Yeah. The hate comes along with it, but it really teaches you a lot about life and, and humans and communication and that, you know, everybody, like we were saying, everyone's different. Not everybody's gonna like you. And sometimes you just have to learn to deal with that. Yeah, and you know what? I found that it's also quite minimal. Like, yeah, I mean, most what we get is so beautiful. And it's like, we're really so lucky so to do that. The majority lucky. of it. You make your own luck. Uh oh, well, I guess it's true. It, thank you, but well, we are very so. lucky. You know, I guess it is what you put out there you receive. Yeah, yeah. But we're very lucky to receive so much love, and I think all we want to do is give it all back. And there will always be a little bit of hate in the world, unfortunately. But when the majority is love, then we're good. And do the best that you can to make more love. More than love, hate. exactly. And, and post more love than hate, yeah. and spread that. All you need is love. So we're in London. Na -na -na. So thank you very much for your lovely presence. Thank, thank you. you. And um, to end this interview, um, would you like to send a message to the Romanian fans? Yes. How do you say I love, love you in Romanian? Romanian. Te iubesc. Te iubesc. Yes. I remember that. Okay. Te iubesc, Romania. Mwah. We love you. Hello. We have stolen her from. It is us. She does not know. Hello, Hello. Martian community has for permission. Hey, <gasps> hope you guys are doing well. Buna dimineta. Te iubesc. Mwah. <laughs> oh my god. That was a great memory. I was about to say, how do you say it?